Yes. Yeah. 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 Sorry. And just one quick second. I know, I know, I had my hand up like a gentleman. I'm sorry, I don't want to be rude. But you did write Pablo Mechanic debunking 9 11 mates. And I know a lot of family members that questions were never answered by the commissioner for. And they demand a new investigation. Any questions that they have, send to me and I'll try to get them. Lee Hamilton and Thomas Keene said they were set up to fail. It's public record they did. We need a new investigation, sir. Thank you. Uh, just going to here is a man named Ed Brown. Uh, he was questioned by Neil Cavuto, actually questioned Representative Ron Paul on the situation with Ed Brown. This is a tax situation. Okay, Ed Brown, all he's asking for is someone to please show him the law. And uniformed U.S. Marshals fired on an unarmed man named Danny Riley on the property several weeks ago. And to avoid an armed conflict, would your office please provide that law that requires the average American to file an income tax? Not very often do I uh, get to absolute cluelessness as to what you're talking about. <laughs> okay, well, Neil Cavuto actually today. interviewed Ron I'm, Paul on this issue. Well, I, I'm sure that Ron Paul is far better informed on this issue than I am, and I was not informed, but I'll be glad to have my staff look at it. I'd be glad well, to. Well, what he's asking for is simply a law uh, that shows that the average American needs to uh, file and, and pay for an income tax. Would you please well, provide that law to Mr. Ed Brown actually, to avoid think, an armed conflict? Actually, I would be glad to tell you that my knowledge of history is that the income tax itself was challenged in the United States Supreme Court and upheld as constitutional. I know that, but I'll be glad to get you other information if you'd like. And no. I'm not familiar with Ed Brown. New independent investigation into 9-11. You no, even no, boldly. No, no. Hold on, hold on. Can I please answer my question? The family members deserve justice, and they're not getting it. No, he didn't. My answer is He ran no. away. My answer, sir, is no. Why don't you agree with the family members? Family members want on, a new investigation. Don't tell me you're shut up. This is freedom of the press. Yeah, well, you're not press. Yes, I am. What do you intend to do? Just ignore me. You know, ignore the family members. Ignore the rescue workers. You know, CIA fund, funded Al Qaeda. We all know that. You know, but ignore us. Ignore the family members. Ignore the rescue workers. You know, CIA fund, funded Al Qaeda. We all know that. You know, but ignore us. Whatever. Why are you ignoring the family members who lost loved ones on 9-11 who demand a new investigation? The CIA financed Al Qaeda, sir. Look, do your research. 9-11 was an inside job, people. 9-11 was an inside job. Don McCain, you will not cover up. You will not disrespect the family members who deserve a new independent investigation into 9-11. The family members have been lied to about what really happened on 9-11. There is a huge cover-up going on, and John McCain is a part of this cover-up. He is lying about 9-11. Al-Qaeda was financed by the CIA in 1979. We funded and trained Al-Qaeda. John McCain is covering up the real parents of 9-11. The real parents is people within our government that did it for war in Iraq, a war in Afghanistan. This is assault, sir. This is assault. Don't assault me. I'm expressing my freedom of speech, freedom of assembly. You do not have to touch me, sir. Do not touch me. I have a message. I have a word. And John McCain is a liar. He's a fear mongerer. Islamofascist always comes out as word. We finance the Islamofascist. The ISI is financed by the CIA. The 9-11 was an inside job, and we know it, and we will not stop until the truth behind 9-11 ain't going to come out. And John McCain, you will be tried for treason for your cover-up of the events of 9-11. 9-11 was an inside job. 9-11 was an inside job, Senator. You know it, you're part of the cover-up. We need you to stand behind the American people, Senator, and tell them the whole thing of government that it's time to hold the 
Father's cousin was a firefighter and he was killed in the attack. Michael Foder. Uh-huh. 